In the presence of the head of the National Guard, Lieutenant General Sheikh Mohammed bin Isa Al Khalifa, the Rashid Equestrian Club organized the 21st horse race of the season. The races were held on the cup of the personal representative of His Majesty the King, Sheikh Abdullah bin Hamad Al Khalifa, Sheikh Khalifa bin Hamad Al Khalifa, Sheikh Sultan bin Hamad Al Khalifa, the cup of the National Guard, and the cup of Batelko. Seven races were held at Rafa area in Sakhir, and the winners were crowned at the end of the races. The Grand Mufti of Russia and Russian Mufti Shura Council, Chairman and President of the Religious Administration of Muslims of the Russian Federation, Sheikh Rawi Yuddin, and his accompanying delegation left Bahrain today following a three-day visit during which he met with His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa. He also held talks with the officials of the Supreme Council for Islamic Affairs, the Minister of Justice, Islamic Affairs and Awqaf, the Royal Charity Organization, Bahrain Economic Development Board, and Bahrain Central Bank on the prospect of enhancing joint cooperation and religious, cultural, charity work and banking fields. He was seen off at the airport by the Vice President of the Supreme Council for Islamic Affairs, Sheikh Abdul Rahman bin Mohammed bin Rashid Al Khalifa, and other officials. He stressed that the visit was successful and the two sides set the foundations for strong development of bilateral relations. He wished Bahrain continued security, stability and prosperity. This is Bahrain now, known as This is the Arabian Gulf, has announced their next visit to Rome, Italy on the 26th of May 2016. The delegation will consist of business people, religious leaders and media personalities from all over the Gulf. More details in this report with Sara Lebrek. The second conference of This is the Arabian Gulf took place yesterday in Bahrain with many announcements that show the success of the initiative, including an invitation from the Minister of Tolerance in the Brotherly United Arab Emirates, Minister Sheikha Lubna Al Qasimi, to This is the Arabian Gulf delegation. We have joined with our brothers and sisters from the GCC countries and we have evolved into this is the Arabian Gulf and this is us implementing, um, we started with this is Bahrain implementing the vision of His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa and to show the true face to the world of the beautiful Kingdom of Bahrain, our tolerance, our religious freedom where every nationality, every culture, every faith has lived together in peace and harmony with mutual respect and love for centuries. We strongly believe that um, Islamophobia is on the rise because of ignorance. Ignorance is the enemy of peace and we feel the best way to beat that is to educate people, to simply share with them the beauty of the true religion of Islam. Um, this is Bahrain and this is the Arabian Gulf will show the true face of the whole of the lifestyle in the Arabian Gulf. 
Bahrain is a thriving business community despite the, um, the global economic problems. Bahrain continues to grow and this is Bahrain as a direct result of our trips. We have seen um, many serious and senior business delegations and businessmen come to invest in the Kingdom of Bahrain as a direct result of This is Bahrain. So our next press conference will be in Riyadh in the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia on the 10th of April because now This is Bahrain has evolved into This is the Arabian Gulf. The Rome visit in May 2016 will include the usual exhibitions in addition to four workshops directed at peace and cohesion whose subjects will be announced at a later time. Uh, as you know that uh, This is Bahrain has been extended uh, recently thanks to the, uh, our brothers, the uh, GCC uh, countries who have really welcomed the idea of This is Bahrain and wanted to share our experience to spread it not only to This is Bahrain but rather This is the Gulf because we have so many in common that uh, make us as a one nation and our culture and value are the same so we will work together for peace, tolerance, coexistence. All this started with the directions of His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa to emphasize the long time existing tolerance of religion in Bahrain. Our church here in Bahrain is completed 52 years and um, uh, all this, all, all throughout these years, uh, Bahrain you know, loved us and uh, the religious tolerance and the freedom of worship and uh, you know, our people are enjoying the freedom, enjoying all privileges of this country. And we love Bahrain because Bahrain is the model of other countries. And we, we, we cannot see a land like this anywhere in the world. This is Sarah Break for Bahrain 55.